All right, guys, we are back at this dang pile where I pushed those two trees over. And we're going to chain them and pull them out and cut them up. That is the plan. I'm going to pull it with the front bucket instead of hooking on the back. See if that, uh, see if we can get it that way first. But that tree right there is laying on this one. But I should be okay to strap it around this big old root here. It's really wet. It just rained a day or two ago. So the ground's real muddy. But we're going to see if we can pull this sucker out. And then we're going to cut it up. Then pull out this other one. Well, we got it pulled out. Now we're going to cut it up a little bit, make it a little easier to drag to the burn pile. And I got a little something. It's locked. I got a, I got me a new chainsaw. New Ryobi chainsaw. It's a gas powered Ryobi. Uh, that electric chainsaw I have is, it's a good saw, but it's not made for cutting stuff like this, you know. Watch that chain now. Don't get your feet and legs near it. I'll cut you. They're coming. Yeah. Don't put that on there. Chain's sharp, man. Sharp? Yeah, it's sharp. What is that? Is that gas? Is that gas? Yeah. Okay. All right. <laughs> See if this bad boy will start on up. Step one. Brakes released. Step two. Primer bolt. Pull three to five times. What? Okay. Choke in.
done for now. Probably should have cut that dang root off of that stump. It's all right. We're gonna unchain this thing. We're gonna unchain it. And pile all this up in one pile and pull the other tree. All right. Take a look at it without that big tree in there. Looks a lot different, doesn't it? I'm debating whether or not I should just cut that tree where it's at instead of pulling it out. I'm not really sure what I should do. I don't know. That root system is still attached just a little bit there. I didn't get it all the way uprooted, but Shouldn't take much more to get it. But, uh, we're gonna take a look here. I might just come in with the tractor and scoop up all this right here. I mean, I see some, uh, dang it, looks like yellow jackets actually. They might have a nest in there, I'm not sure. Definitely yellow jackets though. Dang it. Here's what we're going to do, man. We're going to continue moving this pile right here. We're going to take this pile, get it cleared out. Then we're going to go after that other tree. But first, I got to move that big old stump. So we'll do that. Then we'll get started. But right here is a big dip. There's a hill right here. You'll see when I start digging. But I got to take that out first before I can get down there because it's, it's, not, it's not very safe right now. It's not level. None of it's level. So let me cut this bank out. <clears throat> then we'll get back to the dirt pile.
that made it a little more workable now it's uh not as steep it's pretty smooth now there's a bunch of trash in there a lot more trash than i thought but let's see if we can't get this pile now well the pond dig is on hold again what? we got some more rain Isaac, don't get close to it now. Okay. Let's see if I can get down here. No, I'll leave the big one there. I don't know how deep it is. 